shoppers were encouraged to get out and shop at local small businesses and support them for all they do in their communities. Our Brenda Ordonez has more on what one tri-state town did to support local businesses. Everybody could just go on the internet and buy whatever they want and have a still have a Merry Christmas. But for Bellevue Mayor Charlie Cleves, it's not the same as shopping at your local small business. These little shops are so diverse and they got such neat things to offer. Saturday marked the last day of Bellevue's annual Shop Bellevue Christmas Walk to celebrate Small Business Saturday. Days like this where a lot of people descend down here and buy stuff and, and make their purchases for Christmas here, it means everything to these little stores. Mayor Cleves says last year more than 900 residents participated. And one of the small businesses profiting from events like this is actually owned by Mayor Cleves' son, Michael. We definitely see an increase on Small Business Saturday over other Saturdays. Um, you know, it's, it's for businesses like us, it's a fantastic way to boost the, uh, the holiday sales. Michael says for a small business, community support is the key to growth. We're a community, you know, we all need to work together. And, you know, if you keep the, the value in your community, uh, it, it grows. The Shop Bellevue Christmas Walk started Friday morning and consists of various events, including a tree lighting, which Mayor Cleve says tends to draw hundreds of people. This is what keeps our city alive. You know, this is what brings us together. It holds the whole city together, all this series of little shops. Small Business Saturday was co-sponsored by the U.S. Small Business Administration in 2011. Since then, it has become one of the busiest times of the shopping season for small businesses. The 2022 Small Business Saturday Consumer Survey estimated that consumers who shopped on Small Business Saturday reached an estimated $17.9 billion. These shops need some really good days because, you know, you could have a decent business, but we want them to thrive. We don't want them to just survive. Well, that was our Bernia Ardonez reporting. Many of the small businesses say they are already looking forward to next year. Our Catherine